Today I'm making a video on a couple of e.l.f. Disney products that I got from the Walgreens website. The uh, blush and bronzer combo is actually sold out right now, but you can still get the other items, and the uh, Snow White items are actually about 50% off right now. I think they're on clearance. Um, so we're going to take a look at the e.l.f. Good vs. Evil, uh, Let the Drama Begin Beauty book the Snow White brush set, the Snow White eyeshadows, and the Snow White blush and bronzer. Okay, so first we're going to look at the Good vs. Evil or Sleeping Beauty kit. It opens like a book. On this side you have a mirror. Um, it's shaped like a rose. It's kind of cute, but it's not a very good mirror. It, I don't know if you can see, but it makes things seem kind of small and uh, just warped, but that's okay because I don't really like mirrors. Um, and then you have 12 eyeshadows, two lip glosses, and this eyeliner pencil. pencil. I am going to swatch the shadows real quick over primer. Um, I have primer on the lower half of this arm. It's the Wet n Wild Furby primer. And I'm going to start with this Day Beauty or Sleeping Beauty. These are the swatches from the Sleeping Beauty palette. Um, the a lot of the shades on top, the Aurora shades, don't really show up. Uh, this is Sunlight, which is basically my skin tone. Then there's Innocence, which is kind of a light shimmery gold. There's uh, Briar Rose, which is like a light pink shimmer. Sunbeam, which is kind of a golden bronze shimmer. Forest Beauty, which is kind of a brown with a little bit of blue, shiny, but doesn't really show up. And then there's Woodline, which is kind of a dark brown, Woodland, which is kind of a dark brown shade. Then these are the Maleficent shades, or Night Villain. Uh, there's Sorcery, which is a silver that doesn't really show up too much. Uh, there's Magic Spell, Evil Fairy, Hedge of Thorns, Green Flames, and Black Magic. And these all really have a bit of shimmer in them. I think this one and this one are the least shimmery. And the Good vs. Evil kit also includes two lip glosses and a liner. Uh, the liner is just a Brighten an eyeliner pencil, pencil in black, which goes on like this. I didn't really have much luck with this on the eyes for some reason. I'm not sure if it's because of having too much shimmery shadow on, but it actually goes on pretty good here. So I don't know. And then there's two glosses. Um, this one is called Betrayal in the kit, but it's actually called the shade Michael from the uh, Extra Glosses line. It's kind of a shimmer, slightly shimmery mauve shade. It's actually really quite nice. I actually like these lip glosses. They're really pigmented and not sticky at all. And uh, this one is called True Love's Kiss, or Breath. It's actually Brett from the Extra Glosses line. And it is kind of a shimmery cherry red, I would say. It's also really pretty. And I don't actually have any other makeup on right now, but I have this one on my lips. I think it looks pretty nice. And next we're going to look at the Snow White Bronzer and Blush Palette. I think the packaging is really super cute. Um, just kind of opens like that. And I swatched the blush and bronzer without primer. The blush is very, very light peach. It doesn't really show up too much in my skin. Um, and then there's the bronzer, which is actually pretty nice. It's very soft and pretty pigmented, so that's cool. Uh, then there's a Snow White 6-pan eyeshadow palette, 
It's kind of awkward because it opens from the side. Uh, there was a sponge in here, but I took it out, and it just has a tiny little mirror over here. But it's actually a decent mirror. It's not warped like the, the one in the beauty book. I actually feel like these shadows are a little bit more pigmented than the ones in the Good vs. Evil. They're just swatched better, at least. The other ones still look good on the eyes, but these don't have names. Um, they're kind of divided into, I think, duos. Like, kind of light, dark, light, dark, light, dark. Or you can just do any combination. But there's kind of a goldy shade, black. A really nice shimmery light blue, a more shimmery ocean blue, a very light shimmery shade that I use for a highlight, and then kind of a bronzy color. Finally, I got the Snow White brush set. Um, it has a Velcro closure, and then the brushes are in here. Uh, these are all from the Essential line, so they're, I think, only $1 brushes, but I do like, really like the case. Um, you get the bronzer brush, the shadow brush, the concealer brush, and a powder brush. Now, I do have the regular version of two of these brushes. So, uh, these are the same bronzer brush. The mine's a little more compact here, but it's pretty much the same. Except this one has a little design on here. There's also gold instead of silver, and it's the regular one is just a tiny bit longer. And then I also have the Essential Shadow Brush. Uh, this one is actually a little bit sh shorter, with the Snow White one being a little bit longer. Uh, and it also has the gold and then the little design. I really like the Shadow Brush. Uh, I do like the bronzer brush too for putting on just kind of contouring that works. I haven't used the foundation brush or the powder brush yet, um, but they seem nice. So I'll try them out. Um, so that's all I got. They also had a Sleeping Beauty brush set, but I didn't get that. Um, cause I just kind of liked the Snow White one better and I didn't think I needed both. And there is also a, uh, yeah, Good versus Evil. There's also a Good, there's also a Good versus Evil eyeliner set, but I'm not really a fan of e.l.f. eyeliner, so I didn't think I needed that. Um, so you can get these on Walgreens, and they are limited editions, and they do have a, a jasmine set coming out soon, so I'll probably be picking some of that up. And thanks for watching, and have a good day.